guys welcome to my channel today i will show you how to take a screenshot inside the maya using my custom script it's called screenshot so what you have to do when you download the script from high end 3d you will see this zip what you have to do just right click on it extract files and click on ok when you click on ok inside that folder you will see this refresh icon so what you have to do just copy it go to documents Maya. Right now I am using 2019 version, so I have to go to 2019. If you are using 2017, so you have to go to 2017-18 and whatever it is. So now right now I am going to 2019. Just go inside the 19 preferences icons. So just paste it. Now go back to your pictures folder screenshot. And now what you have to do? Just copy this part and go inside the Maya. And either you can click on this load script or you can go to file load script. Both are same. Just paste that path and click on that screenshot. Now just run the script. As you can see, my script is working fine. You just have to close it. Suppose if you want to reuse this script, so what you have to do, you just have to make a particular button for that. So what you have to do, click select all your script and now just middle mouse button and drag on that particular shelf as you can see that my icon is added and now it is working fine just remember this if you are having so many script and both and all are having the same icon so you won't be able to identify them so what you have to do you just have to either assign the particular custom name or you can assign the icon so i if you want to assign the particular name you just have to type it in that icon label as you can see that icon label but right now I am not going to assign the icon label. I am going to assign it as an icon. Right now it is using Maya default icon. So I want to assign it my custom icon. So what you have to do just click on browse user defined icons and paste that particular link where you have extracted your screenshot folder. Just click on that and as you can see that screenshot uh, icon is there and the it has the camera icon. Just click on it and click on save all shells as you can see that my script has been loaded sorry my icon has been loaded now what you have to do just click on this and as you can see that my script is working fine now what you have to do suppose right now it is working fine but when next time when you are going to restart the maya it is possible that you won't be able to see this icon reason is that you have not saved your preferences so what you have to do just go to file and click on save preferences so next time as you can see that preferences save so next time when you restart your maya you will see this icon in your arnold tab or you can assign it in your custom tab it's up to you now how this script works so first you have to go to outliner as you can see that i'm going to save my file in that screenshot folder let's say file name is P sphere fine and now my now you can see that my path is C user gem pictures screenshot screenshot P sphere and my file name is P sphere okay in that path this path is going to come and in that name this selected object name will come whatever it is if you can see that if there are multiple objects right so whatever you will select that name will come right now the uh, selected object is p square 2 so 2 is in that name section if i select the p square 1 it will come as p square 1 and if you don't want to save that file in that particular folder so you just have to click on that browse and you can select the like let's say lightroom folder it's up to you so right now lightroom folder is not fine for me so i'm going to uh, change it just again click on that refresh button click on screenshot and set select folder that is fine now what you have to do just go to expert mode or you can say full screen mode and just click on the capture button it will automatically capture your viewport as you can see that when i hit the uh, capture button something happened that black black screen came so now what you have to do go back to your folder 
as you can see that my file name is p square so that's how it works thank you so much